Hey guys, it's Nate, aka The Foot Account, and welcome back to the channel. We have some big news today dropped in the code Icon Moments Images. We're going to get right to it, look at some cards, because this is always really, really interesting when we get these images uploaded every year before the Icon Moments actually drop, because we can actually do a little bit of recon work, if you will, a little bit of research, and figure out when these actual moments in that specific icon's career was because what the icon moments cards are is exactly that it's a picture a snapshot moment of a player's career that they are getting a icon upgrade for and these icon upgrades are different from year to year you're going to see some of the dynamic images that they've uploaded are different for almost every single icon than last year or in fifa 19 and that means we could be getting different positions different upgrades and all sorts of things with these icon moments so again ea has told us that these versions will be into packs in February 2021, they did not come out last week, which is when we thought they could, but it's more and more looking like this Friday is when the Icon Moments will come out now that we do have these uh, dynamic images that have been made live. So let's take a peek at some of these, and man, I'm telling you, these are insane. Bastion Schweinsteiger kissing the trophy. That is incredible. I think that's the top dynamic image that I have seen from all these icons so far. Uh, of course, these brand new icons that we've had in FIBA 21, Schweinsteiger, Lam, Suker, Eto, Cantona, all those guys are in here as well for the first ever Prime Icon Moments card. So we're going to be seeing some of those images too. But uh, I'm, I am going to look at a couple people who have done some inside research on Twitter. I'm going to be linking their tweets down below because some of these tweets are absolutely awesome, right? Here's one of the dynamic images for Lam. Let me find the one for Schweinsteiger. Yeah, so this is Weaver on Twitter. I'm going to link his Twitter down below. Really awesome trader and doing a ton of great research on these prime icon moments. Uh, a really nice image, and it looks like basically he found the game from where this picture was taken in, obviously, in the World Cup, and uh, found where he was playing in that game, right? So Schweinsteiger was playing in more of a central position, so of course you would think that this icon Schweinsteiger, icon moments, Schweiny card, would be a midfielder, right? He also uploaded a little uh, research for Mr. Ronaldinho because Ronaldinho uh, looks like this is against Germany in 2005. So instead of having the center attacking mid Ronaldinho that we had in FIFA 20, it looks like we're going to be having the uh, a left wing one like we did in FIFA 19. But again, scrolling down through this list, there's a Drogba, you know, there is uh, Rui Costa. And honestly, if you're somebody who plays FIFA a lot like we do, or like I do, a lot of you guys do if you're watching this video, you know that these images are different, right? There's David Beckham getting an image uploaded as well. That's a pretty dope one. And Zagi, that's different than last year. I, I scrolled through this entire list pretty fast, and I think I only found like one or two of them that had the same dynamic image as last year. Here is Zidane with the shirt pulled up. That's kind of sick. Shevchenko's image looks awesome. Um, I think Ian Wright's looks really dope too uh, with that jersey with the necklaces on as well. That's really dope. Mateus. All right, pretty similar to last year. Um, Suker, right? That's a brand new one. That's a pretty dope looking card. But the most interesting thing is with these moments cards is that they can get kind of crazy boosts, right? I want to look at Mr. Uh, Rush from last year in FIFA 20 because I just want to show you the kind of boosts that these cards could have. Now, of course, they're going to be very expensive right away, and we'll talk about like the actual... Uh, market impact of these a little bit towards the end of this video, but take a look at this Ian Rush 92. This guy got a five star weak foot, whereas his 91 rated card last year only had a four star. But look at this boost a plus one overall boost, but you have plus four pace, plus four dribbling, two shot, two passing. And as we're going to see with some of these icon moments upgrades, EA goes all out. EA goes all out with these upgrades, and that's why looking at these cards and seeing and knowing some of the positions that they could be in is really helpful for kind of projecting what that upgrade could be, right? Here's a Steven Gerrard image. That's pretty dope. You got the Bobby Moore again kissing that trophy as well. That's, I think, one of the coolest images as well. Uh, honestly, will the images make the cards worth a little bit more? Like Schweinsteiger? Absolutely. Bobby Moore? Probably. Although Bobby Moore's Prime Icon Moments card isn't super meta or popular. I think last year some people actually used him, but pace, we need to upgrade on that pace, EA Sports. Anyway, uh, Van Nisselrooy, of course, R9 Ronaldo getting in there. Pele with the look back. The one that I think might be the same is Paul Scholes. Um, because I think Paul Scholes might literally have the same image as he had last year. 
for his prime outcome moments. Is that the case? Uh, prime Skulls, no, that's actually a different image. It's close, but it is different. So that's kind of interesting that Skulls has one right there. Seedorf, Seedorf's is very different. This is one that I noticed right away. Take a look at this. Seedorf goes from the big dreads, the, the flowing hair behind uh, in FIFA 20, which was, I think, pa partially why his card was, you know, very cracked out card indeed, but might be attentive to why his icon was so much, the icon moments card, because of that dynamic image. This year, he's got a very different one with the short hair on Seedorf. Desai has got a different image. Schmeichel, Maradona's image looks really, really, really sick. Uh, I think Weaver had a picture of that one too um, alongside of here. One that I did want to point out that we haven't looked at yet is Yashin. Yashin, known as The Hat in FIFA, um, actually has a hat in his dynamic image. So, of course, if you're a fan of Yashin The Hat, you're hoping that he will be getting, of course, that hat in game. There's Puskas, of course, for his first ever Icon Moments card. It's a pretty good looking image. Roy Keane's got a nice image. Crespo with some flow. Hugo Sanchez with some flow. Lineker got an, uh, that's a, a very, that's a snapshot to definitely earlier in Lineker's career, I believe, based off of the images that I've seen before. Rykard got a new image. George Best with the scruff, you know, that that image kind of reminds me of his uh, middle icon card. Logic with a new one. Nakata, Zola, Clivert, Socrates looks pretty dope. Yeah, there's the Yashin with the hat. Rude Hullet with a brand new image. That one looks pretty cool. There is Cantona with the wave, right? They You knew they were going to give Cantona a pretty dope image uh, just because he is one of the cover stars and like one of the icons that EA is doing a lot of work with this year. Butcho Gueno's got a pretty dope one. That looks like to be a flashback to maybe more of his younger days too, possibly. Kind of looks like um, he looks a little bit younger there, kind of like his middle or his baby icon card. Uh, Rivaldo, it's a dope one. Soul Campbell's image is close to the same, but not exact. Uh, if we go take a look at it last year, he's making kind of the same. He's got the Kimmich face right there. He's got the Kimmich face going on. Um, but let's keep scrolling through these. Cruyff. I think a lot of people are, are interested in Cruyff because um, last year, uh, and actually in the past couple years, people have thought that Cruyff has always got underrated for his Icon Moments card. They have thought that Cruyff's Icon Moments should be like a 97 or a 98. This was his image last year, of course, an insane, insane card. Maybe this year is the year Cruyff gets like a 97. We'll see. They do big stat upgrades for these cards. So there's Perez, Nedved. Del Piero's image looks dope. I'm a huge fan of that one. Same with Baggio. There's Fernando Torres with his first ever Icon Moments. That'll be cool. Vieira, Closa, Carlos Alberto, Ian Rush again as we looked, Alan Shearer. Michael Owens got a pretty good one. Rio Ferdinand is dope. Um, and then this one here says, based on the idea, it should be Cannavaro, but EA used Del Piero's photo from the World Cup 2006 final instead. So I guess we're going to figure out what the Cannavaro image is later. Lampard's got a pretty cool one. Trezeguet as well. Littmanen is there. Raul is dope. Vandersar, Luis Figo, Carlos Puyol. Michael Valak, I think his image is almost the same as last year, but it's it's just slightly different. Um, if I could find Valak, I might have already went past him. Uh, there's Mateus. Let me find Valak really fast because I want to see if that image is the same. It's close. It's close, but it's not the same. Valak kind of here turning to the right with the Kimmich face, as we call it. This time, he's kind of got his hand up there, though. So that's different. Zanetti's pretty cool. Last year, of course, Zanetti had a CDM, I believe, uh, for an Icon Moments card. and uh, Or actually, maybe that was in FIFA 19. Crespo. Um, I do know that Zanetti had a CDM. I don't know if that was both years. I kind of don't remember. Um, I'm going to try to find the card really fast and see what he had. But... Um, actually, I can't find it. I don't know where it is. It's hiding from me. Mr. Zanetti is hiding from me that uh, the Argentinian flag, which I'm looking for, is nowhere to be found. Anyways, um, yo, I kind of want to... Oh, there it is. Yeah, CDM 94. There it is. First page. So he had a 94 rated CDM card last year, of course, with all of his other versions being left back or right back. So that was a big position change for him. Wonderful. Have that again. I'm not sure what moment in time this is from, but it honestly kind of looks like the 87 rated, like the face on this card. The 87 rated baby icon is, looks like from that same era. Moving on, Storchkov, Eusebio, Hierro, Kuman, Gattuso, Vidic. That's a brand new icon. We'll see how that upgrade goes. Philip Lahm, right? That was one that we looked at that Weaver had some imaging for. Um, it looked like this Philip Lahm was playing left back uh, from this dynamic image that EA uploaded. So I was kind of hoping for another like CDM or center mid Lahm, but it's looking like it might be a left back. There's Guardiola, Baresi, 
Uh, Garincha, Deco, Petrcek with the helmet. That's a GG. Hopefully he's got the helmet in game two. Veron, Dalglish's card looks pretty different. That looks more along the time frame of like the mid icon card. Uh, Zambrata, Petit's image is dope. Henri, Haji, Kaká, Vieri, Maldini's looks pretty dope too. Overmars, Barnes, Makalele, Javi, right? First ever uh, icon moments for Javi. Luis Hernandez with some major flow going on there. Larson, Blanc, Essien's looks pretty dope. Pirlo's looks pretty dope. Raquel May, Ashley Cole, and Samuel Eto. So those are all of the icon dynamic images on the moments that we are going to be seeing. And of course, there's going to be some more research that is done on those cards to see if their positions will change and stuff like that. Uh, one thing I would keep a watch out for is probably some of these prime icons, right? We talk market here for a second. Um, this Schweinsteiger is already down a lot. A lot of these icons have been crashing. They've been going down. I don't know if the release of these moments images is going to make people start to maybe sell some of these icons, but it's definitely going to get people in the mindset that icon moments is now 100% coming soon. And uh, I do think you'll see a little bit of sell off on some of these icons, especially some of the ones that look really dope or um, some of the new icons. Honestly, like we talked about Lom. Um, we talked about like if Lom does have a left back card, you know, just kind of keep an eye on this right back one to see if people would sell this and try to get the prime icon moments. Now, of course, when these icons get released, the moments cards, they're going to be very expensive. They're going to be very overpriced day one. Um, and we talked about that a little bit earlier in an icon moments video for specifically for the market. But I think this does kind of begin the conversation of people starting to sell some icons on this game. And you will see some of these cards drop down in price. But Again, right now we're just kind of in the waiting game because we've seen these dynamic images. We've seen the cool cards that could be coming out and the dope dynamic images. And uh, I'm just really curious to see if EA does the boosts right. Last year with the icon moments, they did the boosts right. There were plus one and plus two upgrades to the face cards, but the in-game stats there were plus fours, plus five, and all sorts of big stuff like that. So hopefully this year EA go all out with it again with the upgrades, with some position changes, weak foot upgrades, maybe skill moves. That would be really, really dope if they went all out with some of those cards um, this year like they did last year. Now, of course, the brand new icons, Vidic, you know, Eto that we were talking about, Javi, those cards are going to have a little bit of extra hype to them. They might be a little bit more expensive this year because they are brand new first ever icon moments cards. Of course, with this Vidic, you're probably expecting to have 80 pace or above. The defense in the, the 90s already, if this guy gets plus twos and plus threes, maybe even a plus four or five this card's gonna look ridiculous so um, i'm curious to see how some of these brand new icons that are new to fifa 21 get upgrades and we'll be following the icon market this entire week because a lot of stuff with the entire market itself these icons have followed that trend and have really gone down the past couple weeks um, headed out of team of the year so hopefully ea make it hype they make some big boosts let me know from all these images over here let me know which ones are your favorite I know the thing that hits different about icons is that these are players from the past that are like, it's emotional, right? It just has that connection for a lot of people in FIFA. And that's where the fun in this is. Yes, you might be like, yo, I'm not going to be able to afford any of these. A lot of these guys are going to get cheap a couple weeks after they're in packs. You will have an opportunity to buy icon moments cards for less than 500,000 coins for some of these icons. So it's not necessarily like all of these are going to be super duper expensive, um, but it's just cool to have those dynamic image moments a snapshot from one of these legends career and have that in fifa alden team so let me know which one of these is your favorite of course and if you have a card you're really wanting as well let me know down below in the comments if you enjoyed this hit a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new it's been nate the foot account and i'll catch you guys later peace out